Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel All About Electronics. So in this question, we have been given the circuit, and as you can see through the Zener diode, the output of the op is given to the CMOS logic circuit. So here we have been given that the CMOS logic circuit has an infinite input impedance, and here the given op is the ideal op -M. Moreover, here the op is used in the open loop configuration. That means here the op is used as a comparator. And through the Zener diode, the output of the op is given to this CMOS logic circuit. So here, we have been also given the specifications for the Zener diode. That means here, the Zener voltage of the Zener diode is equal to 1.8 volt, while the minimum required Zener current is equal to 2 mA. So here, we have been asked to find the maximum allowable value of this resistor RZ in a such a way that the Zener diode works properly. So here, we have been given that the input impedance of this CMOS logic circuit is infinite. That means from the Zener diode side, it will act as an open circuit. So here, now this Zener diode will work in the breakdown region whenever the output of this op is equal to 5 volt. And in this condition, the voltage across this Zener diode will be equal to 1.8 volt. And based on the value of this resistor RZ, some current will flow through this Zener diode. So here, this current IZ can be given as this 5 minus this V out divided by RZ, where this V out is equal to 1.8 volt. That means this IZ is equal to 5 minus 1.8 volt divided by RZ, or that is equal to 3.2 divided by RZ. So here, this Zeno diode will work properly whenever the current that is flowing through the Zeno diode is greater than the IZ minimum. That means this current IZ should be greater than or equal to this IZ minimum that is equal to 2 mA. That means here, we need to select the value of this resistor RZ in a such a way that the current that is flowing through the Zener diode is greater than or equal to 2 mA. That means the maximum value of the resistor RZ should be in a such a way that this current IZ is equal to IZ minimum. So whenever this IZ is equal to IZ minimum at that time, the value of the RZ is equal to RZ max. And at that time, we can write this expression as this 3.2 divided by RZ max. So from this, we can say that this RZ max is equal to 3.2 divided by IZ minimum that is equal to 2 mA. That means the maximum value of the RZ is equal to 1.6 kilo ohm. That means if the value of the resistor RZ is more than 1.6 kilo ohm, then this current IZ will be less than IZ minimum. And therefore, the maximum allowable value of the resistor RZ is equal to 1.6 kilo ohm. So from this we can say that for the given circuit, the maximum value of the resistance RZ is equal to 1.6 kilo ohm.